Hey guys, how you doing? Welcome to a beautiful evening in Houston, Texas. We will be installing the rear strut tower bar. Here it is right here. There is the ill. That's the only designation for the entire piece. Don't forget to take your vitamins. This message brought to you by no one. So you will have to remove the side pieces. I just removed a few clips. You just uh, unplug it, twist it 40 degrees counterclockwise. So here's the actuator for the rear spring right here. Pretty interesting. Well, here it is installed. Nothing too difficult. Make sure you don't tighten this bolt too tight so that way you can fit the rod in a lot easier. Yeah, I think so. As you can tell, I did an amazing job professionally putting the holes in the uh, liner. After you torque down those bolts, they want you to rotate the rod in the extension direction towards you. Once it gets to the point where you can't turn it by hand anymore, I took a wrench and uh, just rotated it 90 degrees back that way. Overall, it took about, I don't know, I would say about an hour. This install was more annoying than it was difficult being cramped inside the trunk and having to work around the uh, liner. Interestingly enough, this rod is different than the STI version. The STI version actually puts tension, pulls the pieces together. This one actually pushes them apart, but it is different because it does connect to the strut towers for the rear. Puts a little bit of compression on the body. If you guys have a subwoofer, I have to put it all the the front now. I guess this is called insulation foam for pipes around around the bar to protect it. Also put a little bit of cushioning behind, um, you know, for this big subwoofer. Take it out for a test drive. The suspension is definitely a lot stiffer in the rear. You can feel the rear actually moving with the car in unison. More control creating a much stiffer chassis with that rear trunk bar. Going over dips, the car felt more in control. I can imagine the car being a lot stiffer uh, without the TRD dampers in place. I do like it, very enjoyable. Uh, I feel much more in control with the rear suspension being a little bit stiffer. All right guys, well, that's it for today. Thanks for tuning in and have a great day.